Hello, Funky Fam, and welcome back! As you remember last time, we, uh, we rang the bell. We ran into Ginny Rummy, or Solitaire. The grumpy butt of this game. Now, what we are currently doing is just checking out weapon shops and everything, seeing if anything's better. Ooh. Right. 20 going to the super supers though. Sewers. So that's where we're gonna go. Hello again, my little friend. I have no orders from the boss Monsieur Throw. Quickly take this is that there. <coughs> we received written orders from Warden Trump. Your mission to infiltrate the Master Scout challenge is over. The letter says what it is. I do not know what the water is sinking. I am just a supposing man. And now I must bid you adieu until we meet again, my little friend. Your father has chosen a rather unusual way of communicating with you. So it seems he is saying that your mission for him is over. Now we can focus all our energy on winning the challenge. Yes, we can. And winning is exactly what I'll do. The stools have been hassling the sewer folks. They're looking for snap stuff, I reckon. Or maybe they think the criminals are hiding down there. Every time a crime happens outside, they always say, blame the sewer folk. Aw, poor sewer folk people. Right, Lucius? What's over here? You know what they say, water flows down the gutters. Life in the sewer suits me better than all the scouting silliness. I'm so sad coming in and I'm like a thief, but if it were me, I'd be sending myself on zero file by now. And then MSO suits just don't have my keen understanding. Oh, the criminal mind. Clearly, brother. Look at you, it reminds me of someone. I know, you're the spitting image of the researcher. Trump, I think his name was. He was researching how to communicate with monsters, but there was an accident. He was hurt. Something awful he was. No one knows if he survived. Our father was a researcher. Oh. Okay. So the top upstairs is over, and are they not a care in the world that lot? Yeah, that's not right. And in final time, it gives our freak rub core. I can't wait. I hope they saw it soon. Oh, God, my work shows best items in the sewers. Jazz, mate. Right, we're gonna just work our way around. Shove off me and feels like a middle slime set on it. <clears throat> I've actually become quite comfortable down here. I think I like being in the shadows. Maybe I should give up scouting. You could scout in the shadows. Live down there during the day, come out at night. Eight gold coins. Well, we just stole someone's entire fortune down here, apparently. Alright, lady, what do you got for me? If I was coming out, even my humble calf is busy. But that don't mean I'm gonna open early and come back this evening. Mm. Mommy says we couldn't keep it. Do you want it? It's a mum. Sure. You'll take him? Thanks, mister. He don't have a name yet. We'll give him one, alright? I don't want a mum, though. Mummy. Oh shit, it's a rank A. Look after me mum, okay? Did they do that just for that joke? Lucius, why are you bouncing around? 
you hyper little fuck. It's over here. I didn't want to leap. Lucius, you just... Okay. My cat just jumped headfirst into a window. Some scouts grew up here in the sewers, but they ain't in the final. Silver folk just don't like the spotlight. There's this door in the sewers. What won't open? Looks as solid as a rock it does. Rumor has it that some right unusual monsters are locked up in there. I don't know nothing about no unusual door. Busy feeding the fishies, cool, we. Okay. Cool, see the defense, I'll take it. <sighs> Raphael didn't reach the finals, we all have been supporting him. I feel bad for you guys. Gold nugget, that's something to sell for some good old money. My plan failed, I had hoped to pay off my debts by winning the championship. Looks like my only chance now is to flee overseas. Don't make no sense. How can a monster be a scout at the same time? Not to mention we you were in this challenge. What was the MSO thinking? I don't know. <laughs> Excuse me. Is that here? Oh. That leads us there. Oh, this is the door they were referring to, wasn't it? Locked. Okay. Um, I think we're done looking around. We're done fucking around. Let's pop that seat of defense, yo. The one thing we need to survive is our healer. That's the only way we're gonna win, is if our healer stays alive. Alright, shall we start our finals? Because I think we should. Seven minutes into this recording. Let's do it. I am ready to enter the finals. Okay then, let the games begin. People of Green Base, can you hear the roar? It's the moment you've all been waiting for, the Monster Scout Challenge Finals. Before we get it on, let's hear from our very own Commissioner, Snap! Ahem, uh, why, uh, thank you, thank you everyone. Oh, I'd like to congratulate the five finalists and remind them to do their best. Never give up, even if you lose a bout. Because your next opponent might be fighting for their fourth consecutive victory, everyone is looking forward to a thrilling battle fought in the spirit of fair play. Now good luck to you all, and may the best scouts win! Oh, one thing you gotta love about our commission, keeps it short and snappy! Okay, fight fans, you waited long enough. Let the games begin! Let's meet the zoo scouts who will be kicking off today's action. First up, Funky, the Joker with a bright feature and seriously spiky hair. And he'll be up against Slimin. Prepare to be slimed. Sorry, I accidentally hit something. Ready? Fight! So we have to do four fights in a row without healing, essentially. Wow. This is very, um, underwhelming. To say the least. Also, our speediest is incredibly weak. There's one dead. Now kill Slimo. Or... Okay, there we go. Oh. He takes a deep breath, but he doesn't do a breath attack. Okay. 209 damage. I'll take it. Mmm. My neck. Did you hear that? Funky is the winner. He will now fight in the next round. His pun is the tarnest, youngest, and sweetest competitor, Little Miss Missy. 
I'm gonna beat you and solitaire, so there. And then eat lots of cake. Ooh, that girl's after my heart. Get that cake. Ready? Fight! What do you got, little missy? Oh, you got a giantess, a stone man, and a giant fro fro. Sorry, brother, but you aren't taking my MP. Yeah. My team is basically set up for end game, post game, at least. My Curie is almost completely there, and our Buff Loger is definitely there for end game damage and everything, so. We won against Team Missy. Funky is the winner. That's two in a row for young Funky. But here comes challenger number three. It's the Were Tiger. It's the King of the Jungle and then Catastrophe Man Eater Triger. Or I don't live in the jungle and I'm certainly not a man eater. This is just a costume, you know. I'm actually more of a city per <coughs> person. Ready? Fight! Alright, what do you got? We've got a Bolo and a Garuda. Oh, this is GG's. You know, Buffo, you could really reduce the amount of damage our team takes if you just attack one monster. But, whatever. And there we have it. That's three matches in a row. Funky is the winner. Incredible. The rookies came out of nowhere and is a victory away from the championship. Can he do it or will the next challenger stop him in his track? Most skill challenge. Final round. Here she is, the one you've been waiting for. It's Solitaire, the scout challenge idol herself. Thanks for warming up the crowd for me, but I'll take it from here. I'm a bit surprised you made it this far. I guess you're not as useless as I thought, but this game ain't big enough for the both of us, kiddo. Even with two screens. Huh. <laughs> what can I say? I didn't look for stardom. It came looking for me. You talk too much. It is time to settle this once and for all, Ginny Rummy. Ready. Fight. Listen, doggy. I warned you already. Don't call me Jenny Rummy. A flying kick! The match had to be suspended while MSO staff drags Solitaire away, kicking and screaming. Plunk and the other challengers left the arena and returned to the lounge. What the heck just happened here? Whoa, check it out, the commissioner has entered the air arena. Uh, yes, well, what a surprise. <laughs> what we have here is a case of a scout attacking an opponent's monster. According to section 84 of the MSO Challenge Rulebook, the scout in question, Miss Jimmy Rum, uh, um, I mean, Solitaire, is in violation of the rules and subject to immediate disqualification. Funky wins by default. I'm sure many of you are unhappy with this, but that's the end of the challenge. What a crazy turn of events challenge, Vince, but hey, that's the MSO for you. In any case, we have a champion. Funky wins the seventh Monster Scout Challenge. Stick around, fans. The award ceremony is coming up. Hell yeah. Congratulations, young Funky. It was a rather unusual final, but you are undoubtedly the champion, and you certainly have a monster that any champion would <laughs> kill for. He's not even that good of a monster. Hmm, speaking of which, it appears I was mistaken. I did not see it before, but there is great power within you. What do you mean? Hmm? Oh, nothing. Never mind me. <clears throat> Sorry to interrupt, Commissioner, but the crowd is waiting. 
Whoops, I was in another world. I hope no one noticed. Well, it's a business. Now, where is that prize? Oh, fiddlesticks. I prayed I'll let the scouts march in my office. Huh? But what about the itch award ceremony? Ha 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 ha. Yes, I'll have to give you the prize later, young man. Please come to my office. Well, so much for the award ceremony. Well, I guess that's it. Seventh Monster Scout Challenge is over. And what a great way to end it all. If I fans, see you at the next challenge. Yeah, we just blew through it. So, Foggy was named champion of the 7th Monster, Monster Scout Challenge. Congratulations, Foggy. The award ceremony will take place in the commissioner's office. He's waiting for you there now. Thanks. Mm -hmm. We go to the commissioner's office. Ah, oh, there you are. I've been waiting for you. Now to business. Let's award the prize, shall we? I will be taking the mock. Isn't that right, Bunker? Yeet. Oh, was that your arrangement? How interesting. Of course, I don't mind one bit. In fact, that was my all that was always my intention. Now come to me, my noble monster. At last, the mark is finally mine. Well done. Yours has been a long and difficult journey, but I too have long awaited for this moment. My monster friend, or should I say, Incarnus. Uh-oh. Now I shall imbue you with the power of this Darconium Sphere. What an evil man. Curse you! What, what are you doing? The scouts challenged collected vast quantities of Darconium, enough Darconium for me to construct this sphere. Can you resist its power, I wonder? We shall soon see. Nope. We got Evil Doggy up in here. My mission is to open the gate to the Dark World. Give me the Mark Human. This is not the true mark. What? That cannot be. But of course, I have been blind. Those thieves did take the mark and they replaced it with this fake. I sense the mark. It is far from here. You can sense it then quickly. Take me to it. What is the mark to you, human? What do you want? With your body and soul steeped in dark matter, you must surely know what I want. I'm the one who will help you complete your mission. Mm -hmm. Good. Come with me. Out of my way. Well, we got absolutely fucking wrecked by our own monster. Hey, you. Hello? Can't sleep in here, you know. Come on, get up already. Time to move your lazy butt. Oh, God. She's beating us. Oh, are you awake? And I was just about to give you another solitaire super punch. Anyway, what happened here? I came to the commissioner's office to check out the scout's mark, but all I found is you crashed out on the floor. The mark was supposed to be mine and that pet monster of yours. Where are they? Ahem, are you gonna tell me what's going on? Hello, can you hear me? Huh, are you sulking again? You only won the stupid championship because I let you, you know. Now here's the thing, I don't know how they're supposed to tell you where to go. I think somebody pops out right here, maybe. I'm just gonna head where we need to go. Cause I know where to go. Actually, hold on. Which time just left on a sea scooter, he's bound for Infant Isle. Okay, so it is this way. I knew that. How many sea scooters do they have? Since so many scout trainers, you know, would be going back and forth. Now, if I plan this better, life would be better. Alright, 558 is the next level, 743 is the next level. Alright, I need to um, switch my substitutes. 
And this is what I've been grinding up. A Mr. Arms. Level 20. Rank A. Monster. I told you at the very beginning a Serpent was going to be on our team. And that's exactly what I did. Holy f- where did that guy come from? He just appeared out of fucking nowhere. But yeah, he makes up for the Incarnus, because we do not have the Incarnus until we beat the game. Well, actually, no. We can free the Incarnus partway through the final boss, but I have no more use for him. He's weak. And, yeah. So the Incarnus is no longer going to be on our team. Sorry, Speedius, but I don't need you. Nor do I really want you. I mean, sure, I could have bred better, or actually bred him and made him useful, but I was just like, why? What's the point? There's really no point in me breeding him. He doesn't change anything. Actually, after you beat the game, you can bring him back into his different form. So if you like the Klaboon, you can have the Klaboon. If you like the Raptor, you can get the Raptor. If you like the burnt chicken, you know, you can have the raw chicken. Alright, back to Furt Island. Oh. Oh. I don't like this island. Like, there's not even challenges there, so... And here we go. <sighs> I'm gonna pop in here real quick just to set this as our zoom. Oh shit, we're out of time! So, thank you everybody for watching this! We will be picking up this again next time. Uh, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe as we continue on with this masterpiece. So, thank you everybody again, and until the next time. Stiff Funker Purple!